Meridian Passage When a celestial body passes the observer's meridian, the spherical triangle for solving the position fix collapses to become a simple linear calculation. With the declination derived from the almanac for the time of observation and the altitude corrected for errors, we can deduce the latitude of the observer. Example 1 First, get the meridian passage from the almanac's page. Here it says, 11 hours and 59 minutes, or 18th April 2001. Change the longitude to time by dividing the longitude 160 degrees 16 minutes by 15 degrees. We get 10 degrees 41 minutes and 4 seconds. Now subtract this from LMT Meridian Passage to get approximate GMT Meridian Passage. When sun passes the meridian, the LHA should be 360 degrees. Subtracting the longitude from this, we get the GHA of the body. However, when applying the approximate GMT to get the GHA, we get 195 degrees 9.1 minutes. The difference between the two will give us the increment, which when referring to tables in the increment page for 18 minutes, we get 19.5 seconds. Now we use the corrected time of 1 hour, 18 minutes and 19 seconds to get the declination of the body. To get declination, first get the declination for the hour, 18th date, first hour, which gives 10 degrees and 47.1 minutes. The bottom of the column gives D as 0 0.9. With this, get the D correction from increment page of 18 minutes, which gives 0 degrees, 0.3 minutes. Apply this correction to the declination to get the corrected declination of 10 degrees, 47.4 minutes north. Apply index error to the sextant altitude to get observed altitude of 79 degrees and 33 minutes. Dip correction for 20.4 meters will be 0 degrees and 7.9 minutes. On applying this to the observed altitude, we get the apparent altitude of 79 degrees and 25.1 minutes. Now, get the total correction for sun's lower limb for 79 degrees and 25.1, which is minus 00, 00 degrees and 16.1 minutes. Applying this to the apparent altitude gives the true altitude of 79 degrees and 9 minutes. This is subtracted from 90 degrees to get the zenith distance of 10 degrees and 51 minutes. Difference of true zenith distance and the declination gives the latitude, which is 0 degrees and 2.6 minutes south.